everybody. You're doing the intro. Oh, well, okay. What's up, guys? Um, this is another Unity tutorial on how to add stuff to your Guerrilla Tech fan game. Today, we're gonna teach you how to add cosmetics okay. like these to your Guerrilla Tech fan game with Mosa w. Jr. I, I, Yay! Yeah. Yay! 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 What the heck? Okay. But anyways, let's get straight to the tutorial because I'm not here to waste any time. First, what you want to do is go to your hierarchy, click the plus 3D object, and then make a cube. This will be your stand, by the way, for like the thing, so make it look good. Um, yeah. I'm just going to scale like that. Then, right click on it in the hierarchy, and then press 3D object, cube, and then this will be your enable and disable button, so you want to make it look good also. Um, I'm just going to do that. Okay. Right. Yeah, and then from there, after you make it scaled good and all that, just make sure to paste it. And then put it on the other side. It's going to look like this. I don't know. Actually, I'll just redo it. Or what? Alright, well, don't it, it'll that. be fine. It'll be fine. And then, just drag on a material so they know what is enable and what's disable. And then... After that, you're going to go to my Discord server link in description, and you're going to go to the cosmetics channel and download all these. And then from there, um, oh wait, yeah, by the way, make sure you download this, um, oh, this purchase thingy. Download this, by the way. And after that, you're going to drag on the script so for example if the cosmetic is let's say a uh, head cosmetic you'll drag on change head cosmetic so whatever it really is you can just drag on that script for it i'm just gonna drag it on this make sure to drag it on both of the buttons but don't drag it on this block because it's not gonna work and it will be act like this is your enable or disable button and then, anyways, from there, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to Assets. And also, just a little reminder, make sure you have Photon VR set up or this isn't going to work. And then go to Resources, Photon VR. Double click on your player model. And then from there, you're just going to want to make your, like, your um thingy, like your cosmetic. And then I'm just going to make this really goofy cosmetic that I did texture. Then you get flashback. Nah, that's crazy. Alright, and then from there, you're gonna copy this name. And then disable it. And then go out of your player and your hierarchy. And then on the enable button, paste this. I really on fell the head. Off the but for this, do not paste anything in your disable <laughs> button, or it's gonna act like an enable button too. And then after that, you're gonna right click on the cube in your hierarchy and then oh, just make a new cube this I'll is fall be, once again this is going to be your purchase button make sure it covers up both of the buttons so that no one can press the buttons yeah sigmas and then just make sure it looks good i'm not making it look good because this is just a tutorial. yo you, you you know we shouldn't do this part because it requires photon yeah i said make sure you have photon okay but anyways and play fab and play fab yeah, you need, well, yeah, you do need play fab. And then, on the purchase thingy, Majiggy, you're going to drag in the purchase script that I told you guys to download. And then, what you're going to do now is paste in that name that you had. And then, in coins price, just change it to how many, many, like, of your currency it's going to cost. And then... For PlayFab login, you're going to click the circle thingy. It's not popping up because I don't know why. But you're going to click PlayFab Manager. Make sure you double click that. And then, for where it says Disable, drag in your um Disable thingy. Your Disable button. And same for Enable. And then, I'm pretty sure, I'm like 100% no. sure, you are done. Um... No, you are not done, in fact. Uh, you're gonna want to watch this tutorial on how to make your current- Okay, right, well, ignore what he said, guys, but we'll mention what he said in another tutorial. But anyways, that's really all you have to do. 
If you guys want a tutorial on how to add this thingy or like anything like mod vents, I will help you guys with that or like leaderboard or low gravity. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and yeah, see ya.